Brigadier General Wilma L. Vaught, USAFR Ret, born March 15, 1930, is a retired American military leader. She was the first woman to deploy with an Air Force bomber unit, and the first woman to reach the rank of Brigadier General from the controller field. Education <inaudible> 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 Vaught graduated from the UIUC College of Business in 1952. She received her MBA from the University of Alabama in Tuscaloosa in 1968. In August 1972, she became the first female Air Force officer to attend the Industrial College of the Armed Forces at Fort Leslie J. McNair. Military <inaudible> <inaudible> career <inaudible> Vought joined the military in the 1950s, when there were strong restrictions on the number of women who could be in the military and the capacity in which they could serve. Some of these policies changed in 1967 due to an increased need for human resources caused by the Vietnam War. Vought then became an officer and was deployed to Vietnam. In January 1957, Vought was commissioned a second lieutenant and completed her basic training at Lackland Air Force Base in San Antonio. She then spent three months as a student at the Statistical Services Offices course at Shepard Air Force Base, Texas. In September 1957, she was assigned to the 805th Air Base Group, Barksdale Air Force Base, as Chief of the Data Services Branch and, as an additional duty, commanded the women in the Air Force Squadron Section. Vought served at Zaragoza Air Base, Spain, as Chief of the Management Analysis Division, 3974th Combat Support Group, from April 1959 to April 1963. Returning to the United States, she then was assigned to the 306th Combat Support Group at McCoy Air Force Base in Florida, as Chief of the Data Services Division. She later became Chief of the Management Analysis Division for the 306th Bombardment Wing there. During this period the general became the first woman to deploy with a strategic air command operational unit when she served a temporary duty tour as executive officer and chief of the management analysis division, 4133rd Provisional Bombardment Wing at Anderson Air Force Base, Guam, during Operation Arc Light. From June 1967 to September 1968, Vought was a graduate student at the University of Alabama. Her next year was spent as a management analyst in the office of the Deputy Chief of Staff, Controller, Military Assistance Command, Vietnam, in Saigon. Upon completion of the Southeast Asia tour of duty in November 1969, she was assigned to Headquarters Air Force Logistics Command, Wright-Patterson Air Force Base, Ohio, as Chief of the Advanced Logistics Systems Plans and Management Group where she remained until July 1972. In August 1972 Vought began attending the Industrial College of the Armed Forces. From July 1973 until November 1977, Vought was assigned to the Directorate of Management Analysis, Office of the Controller, Headquarters U.S. Air Force, Washington, D.C. She was Chief of the Cost Factors Branch and later became Chief of the Security Assistance Division. Vought was next assigned to Air Force Systems Command Headquarters as Director of Programs and Budget in the Office of the Deputy Chief of Staff, Controller. The General became the Command's Deputy Chief of Staff, Controller, in March 1980. Vought was promoted to Brigadier General September 8, 1980, with date of rank September 6, 1980. She is the first woman selected for promotion to Brigadier General in the Controller career field. She assumed command of the U.S. Military Entrance Processing Command in June 1982. The General served as the Senior Military Representative to the Defense Advisory Committee on Women in the Services and was Chairperson of the Committee of Women in the NATO Armed Forces. In 1983, General Vaught was given the Illini Achievement Award by the University of Illinois, an award given annually to recognize the accomplishments of distinguished graduates. She also served as President of the Board of Directors of the Pentagon Federal Credit Union from April 1976 to July 1982. She is the only woman in its history to hold this position. 
Her military decorations and awards include the Defense Distinguished Service Medal, Air Force Distinguished Service Medal, Legion of Merit, Bronze Star Medal, Meritorious Service Medal, Joint Service Commendation Medal, Air Force Commendation Medal with Oak Leaf Cluster, Air Force Outstanding Unit Award Ribbon with Oak Leaf Cluster, National Defense Service Medal, Vietnam Service Medal with Four Service Stars, Armed Forces Reserve Medal, Small Arms Expert Marksmanship Ribbon, Republic of Vietnam Gallantry Cross with Palm, and Vietnam Campaign Medal. Activity after military career Vought became concerned that the role of women in the military was going unnoticed, and pushed for a memorial as the leader of the Women in Military Service to America Memorial Foundation. This resulted in the Women in Military Service for America Memorial being built at the entrance to Arlington National Cemetery. In 2000, Vought was inducted into the National Women's Hall of Fame, and in 2010, she was inducted into the Army Women's Foundation Hall of Fame. <laughs> 